No Bernard and Perlita and Oyster Cracker Man and everybody's from a night day. They sent you guys to that big of pain in the ass. Jim Baldo, Walt, Karen, Carney's Country and Western, Get Him Life. Um, Jim Baldo, Walt Morgan, Steve Jones, Perlita and Dave. Since you're that big of a nuisance in that bag, Robo Night Dumb. The point is, they probably circumvented two people multiple times in a row. You're that big of a fat, uh, dumbass, Bernard. Episcopal churchman, Indian woman. I mean, if you're, like I said, that violent, dumb, like I said, they just hand it over to the Negroes and let you guys pretend the carny in. <clears throat> I told you, Bernard, I warned her a long time ago. They killed me over it. Karen and then dead. Harry and then dead. But I warned her a long time ago. My wife is real. I just haven't seen her for a long, long time. Um, Bernard, you and your carnies and ghetto life in country and western didn't win. Because they viewed St. Vincent's for their test bent for a long time. And so now they went after the Schwartzes. So this is how they do it now, Bernard. They do work to birth people out of the shit mess. Like I said, you either like to live in it or you don't. Trust me, there are people in the world, Bernard, that can work wonders. They have a talent and skill that most of you could only hope to dream of. Um, but Bernard, I warned her a long time ago. And so that's what some of those guys do. You want to run around and be a dumb, crazy carny and wreck everybody's shit, Bernard. But trust me, Perlita and Dave, the Rubble Knight and see the Oyster and the other man and all that shit, they ain't got uh, not even close. And, uh, Chances of you guys seeing the cool stuff like we used to do, pretty no. Because you have to really be born in a certain area of life. But what happened down there is true. And Mr. Man keeps following and stalking me over it. But like I said, direction of travel. You guys are following to get something from somebody else too. So if you guys come follow me and stalk me based upon the Schwartz and a few other families or the Hilton, then are they kind of and your obsession as well with my cousins, it kind of means that you guys told it and you're learning how to try to use something. Follow the leader. Sign language, all that stuff. Karen, you know, Perlita's family deaf. Karen had another deaf friend. Point is, is that, uh, you know, what you people want is pretty difficult. Um, I would have left it alone when it was working instead of coward cowarding out and changing it around. That's why you're de-evolving because you guys are trying to evolve into something else based upon another principle. Is Brian trying? Maybe. But not if you're going to sit there and talk shit and try to come up with all this proof when you don't know what you're talking about. Carney, Bernard, and every country and western and ghetto like for Perlita and Dave. He might prove some things, but come on, Bernard. If he knows that it never belonged to you originally, you guys destroyed and trashed us and then come up with a deaf excuse. You destroyed the three of us that couldn't hear, but to only replace it with your other. Your proof for all night and day means shit. Because it means it didn't belong to any of